other. What would kindness do? That's a phrase I use a lot with my clients and I use it with myself pretty much every day as well. And I heard it in a in a seminar many, many years ago. I can't even remember who who said it, but it's something that um, I've very much taken on board and through my work with people in, in a coaching capacity, it's always a good thing to check in with. Now, when we talk about kindness, it's about having, you know, good intent. It's about, you know, trying to help other people. Um, it's trying to maybe help them find solutions. OK, now a question that regularly comes up is, that, well, look, if I'm trying to be kind, will I come across as weak? And I would argue the opposite. I think you're actually showing great strength when you're showing kindness. Now, keep in mind as well that um, kindness, you know, I, you have the best will and intention towards other people and also that you're assuming good intent from people as well. Well, if you can take that approach, what it means is that you might end up actually having to have a challenging conversation with somebody. So it's not all about support, though obviously that's a very important part of it. Um, it might be a little bit more challenging as well. But again, so long as you do it in the right way, with the right intent, and you also take the right approach because you've got to know the person a little bit, then it can have really, really big impacts as such. Um, I was working with a client recently and again, they were dealing with a challenging situation. Uh, it was quite, quite frustrating. And again, you know, rather than maybe waving in and, and kind of uh, taking a more aggressive approach, said, OK, look, maybe there's something going on. And of course, what actually happened was that there was something uh, going on in the other person's personal life that they weren't aware of. And when they actually took the slightly kinder approach and had the conversation, all of a sudden the person opened up there was a far greater understanding and they managed to resolve the situation in a very positive and a very, very productive way. Because none of us really know what's going on in somebody else's life. So something that served me well and has served my clients well is, you know, start from a point of kindness and ask yourself, look, what would kindness do in this situation? And um, I've never regretted that. And I've certainly got lots of very, very positive feedback from the people I work with as well. So something just to keep in mind today uh, could be a good approach and could lead to a deepening of relationships and uh, a lot more productivity uh, within teams as well. So I hope that helps.